it's Christmas. Hi guys, Space Monkey here. So this video was made for people who are streamers or want to become one. And if you're none of these, watch the video anyway to possibly learn something new. So today I'm gonna show you how to make this really cool webcam overlay for your live streams. And by the way, this channel is really close to hitting 50 subscribers and I would really appreciate um, if you can help me out with that. But anyway, let's start with the tutorial. So first thing, you make a new layer and go to the tools and select the square tool. Then go to the tool options and make sure the fill is selected to no fill and outline to brush. Then go to size and type in uh, 1020 80 times 720 and make sure that these two um, numbers are locked. So then go to the pixel to the pixel size and uh, put it to 10 and choose the color of uh, the white. Then just simply click on the screen. So then make another layer and go back to the tool options and make the size uh, 1260 pixels times 700 pixels. So then choose the color that you're going with. I'm going with this uh, nice purple color and click OK. Um, and then make another uh, rectangle inside. Then uh, uh, click on the moving tool and with arrow keys position uh, uh, this rectangle in the middle of the first rectangle. So then uh, I'll click on the selection tool and select the outer square. And then select a dark and a light color that you're gonna use. Uh, for me, I'm gonna use dark purple and light purple. Then click on the gradient tool and from the button to the top, while holding shift, make a line. And now you got this really cool effect. Then make another layer and click on the rectangle tool and select under the tool options uh, no outline and fill foreground, foreground color. Then make another uh, small rectangle and position it into the center. Uh, next go to the text tool and type in your name. I'm using this font called Hemihead, uh, link is in the description. Make it big enough and position it into the rectangle. Then right click on the text layer and go to the layer style. Put on some drops, shadow and inner glow effect. When you're happy with that, make another layer. Then click on the polygonal selection tool and uh, go to the one of the corners. Uh, make a shape like that and fill it with white color. Then duplicate the layer and click Ctrl T. Right click and flip it horizontally. Then just posi position it in on the other side. Next merge these two layers. And do the same with the bottom. And the last thing you have to do is to do almost the same thing on the text box, but do it like that. If this tutorial helped you, make sure to subscribe and leave a like. Uh, and I'll see you next time. Bye!